sa inyo. Thank you for representing your respective barangays. And now, ladies and gentlemen, our contestants have prepared tirelessly for this moment. So are now ready to flaunt their eloquence and depth of character. This is the game changer, the deal breaker in the competition. The interview round. You know what, Sam? This round is not just about what they say, uh, but how they say it. Uh, confidence, poise, and articulation are key. And each candidate will pick a question uh, from a list prepared by the organization. Uh, So now it's time to begin with Mutia number eight, representing Lumang Bayan. Please choose a question. Okay, candidate number eight, your question is. If you had to change one thing about your past, what would it be and why? Again, the question is, if you had to change one thing about your past, what would that be and why? Thank you. I know this will sound cliche, but if I had to change one thing from my past, I wouldn't change anything. Because I wouldn't be in here standing in front of you if it weren't for my struggles, from the challenges that challenged me from the past. From the past, um, I knew that I am not really that confident, but look at me now standing in front of every one of you representing my beloved barangay. Thank you. Once again, thank you so much, Mutia number eight. Thank you so much. Representing Lumang Bayan. Uh, and now it's time to call on uh, Mutia number 13, uh, representing Masipi. Please pick your question. Our question for you. Tell us one cause that is close to your heart and how you plan to advocate for it during your time as mutya ng lungsod ng kalapan. Again, tell us one cause that is close to your heart and how you plan to advocate for it during your time as mutya ng lungsod ng kalapan. Hi, good evening. Um, for, for your information, I joined here um, this pageant, not just because because of beauty, because of money, because of prices. I joined his be here because I have a purpose. And that purpose is I want to emphasize and make awareness for mental issues. Because we, the people of Kalapan and the world, rather, is something we need to invest for. Thank you. Thank you so much for your answer. Thank you so much. Candidate number 13. And now... It's time to call on candidate number 15, uh, Mahal na Pangalan. Please choose your question. Please choose your question. Your question is, tell us the greatest obstacle you've had to overcome in your life. Once again, Tell us the greatest obstacle you've had to overcome in your life. Honestly, we are a broken family and I'm an independent woman. And at a young age, I can support my family at the age of 16. The obstacles that I have encountered only made me stronger and graceful. So this is the supporting my family while actively joining pageant and Balancing my academic responsibilities. Thank you. Once again, uh, thank you so much. What are number 15? Uh, and now let's call on Mutia 
number one, Lazaretto. Wow, for those of you who don't know, this is the place I used to represent when I joined Mutia ng Kalaban. All right. Uh, okay, so, so you can pick your question you pick from your here. Question. Hope Sam is your lucky charm tonight. We, we hope so. Okay, your question is, if you win Mutia ng Lungsod ng Kalapan 2024, what can we expect from you? Again, if you win Mutia ng Lungsod ng Kalapan 2024, what can we expect from you? As a woman athlete, my biggest role in the society is to inspire and empower others. Through my dedication to sport, I aim to break stereotypes, promote resilience, and inspire others to pursue their passions fearlessly. I believe in my platform to advocate for equality and to showcase the strength and capabilities of women in the athletic realm. Thank you. Once again, uh, that is your candidate number one representing Lazaretto. Thank you so much, candidate. And now it's time to go on uh, with your number six, Santa Isabel. You may now choose your question from Please these choose set your of question. cards. Okay. With your number six, Please name something uh, that Kalapan City has to offer to the rest of the world. Once again, uh, please name something uh, that Kalapan City has to offer to the rest of the world. Thank you for that question. We all know that Kalapan is a city of progress, discipline, and compassion. And if I would name that one could offer is that Calapenos have unity, resilient, and empowered. And as a Calapena, I know that we have a purpose. And our purpose is to become a blessing to others, to see the good in themselves and their true value in life. Thank you. Thank you so much, Matia number you, six. Santa Isabel. And now. It's time to go on uh, with the number 17, uh, Santo Nino. Please pick your question. Our question is. If you could have a superpower, what would it be and why? Again, if you could have a superpower, what would it be and why? Well, thank you. I believe if I have a superpower, it would be the act of kindness. Because I believe that if you have act of kindness with a pure intention, you have the ability to empower women. Especially as we celebrate the International Women's Month, I am here, standing here with a great confidence, with a great purpose, because I am here to inspire a lot of young women. Thank you. Once again, thank you so much to you, Motia number 17, representing Santo Nino. And now it's time to call on Motia number 11, uh, representing Tawiran. Uh, You may choose the question from this set of cards. All right, your question is, if you could break one law for one day, what would it be and why? Again, your question is, if you could break one law for one day, what would it be and why? Good evening, everyone. 
we all know that poverty is scattered all over our world. And to prevent this, I would break the law of robbery. Because, but in moderation and in great responsibility. But, and if I would break this, I would definitely give those things to, to people who is in need. Thank you. Once again, thank you so much, Mutia number 11, uh, representing thank the Wira. And, uh, and now, let's call on Mutia number 18, uh, representing Baruyan. Uh, hello, please pick your question. Our question for you is, as Mutian ng Lungsod ng Kalapan, how can you empower your fellow youth to take action on climate change issues? Again, as Mutian ng Lungsod ng Kalapan, how can you empower your fellow youth to take action on climate change issues? As Mutian ng Lungsod ng Kalapan, I will empower and influence my fellow youth to be um, to be careful to their doings and we should promote the conservation of our natural resources energy conservation and as my channel in Sod ng Kalapan I will influence the youth thank you, thank you Baruyan Thank you so much, Matia number 18. Just a reminder for everyone who wants a candidate this answering, please do refrain from unnecessary noises. So now, it's time to call on uh, Matia number 5, uh, representing personas. Okay, your question is, tell us the greatest obstacle you've had to overcome in your life. Again, tell us the greatest obstacle you've had to overcome in your life. Good evening. The greatest obstacle I have overcome in my life is when I learned uh, to... Uh, when I learned the real definition of beauty in this world that is often emphasized superficial beauty I think it is crucial for us to understand that the real definition of beauty goes beyond physical appearance because when we realize that it shines straight and inspire others to do the same thank you thank you so much Matia number five uh, and now it's time to call on Matia number seven Santa Maria village Hello, so, Mutia number seven, please pick your question. Our question for you is what makes Kalapan City unique? Again, what makes Kalapan City unique? What makes Kalapan City unique? Uh, maliban po sa mga ganda nating lugar is its people, our Kalapanos. We Calapenos, we can, we can consider ourselves as unique one. Why? Because this is because we are not just a people. We are one community who are helping each other, helping each other to stand up for our community. Because despite all of the struggles, we are all individuals who aims for a for a better tomorrow. And that will be all. Thank you. Once again, a big hand uh, for Mutia number seven, the Santa Maria Village. And uh, that concludes our question and answer for our top 10 candidates.